Hello all the awesome people out there, my name is Takira and welcome to this let's play of Control. This is the Ultimate Edition. Um, I know I have been talking a lot about playing this game actually. Um, over the last year, maybe more. Um, but now that I have a computer that can actually run the game, it is time to jump into it. Uh, I will just take a new game here. This is going to be weirder than usual. Yes, yeah, he kind of explains it already. <laughs> Can't be helped. You called me. So here I am. I know I shut you out sometimes. That's okay. I'm always glad to hear from you. It's just that I get my hopes up. So many times it's led to nothing. I found nothing. It's like... We live in a room. And there's a poster on the wall. It happens. I have a lot of posters on my wall, so... We stare at it <laughs> and we think that's the whole world. Okay, I don't do that. The room... And the poster. The picture's something nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie. Oh, what is it called? The prison movie. The room's a cell, and the picture, it's different for each of us. It can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. But it's all a lie. Something to distract us from the truth. Okay. They're lying to us. We are lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes... Sometimes something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. Say enough. I'm here. Did you crawl Why out from the poster? You bring me here. <laughs> Hello? And we're in the game. Anyone okay. here? Just want to get a feel for my controls. Oh God, my mouse is sensitive. Can I turn it down a notch? Okay, I like it there. I'm really glad that I have adjustment on my mouse, so I can just adjust the sensitivity on it from there, so I don't have to go into the settings. I'm gonna jump, crouch, that sprint. I don't have a crouch apparently. If that was a weird button to have for that. Um, <laughs> and here my mouse is turning slow. Okay, I have to lift that. Uh, certain objects are not allowed inside the bureau. Uh, re uh, recent incidents uh, have necessitated an issue reminding on prohibited materials. Unauthorized weapon, pages, laptops, uh, smartwatches, smartphones, smart gaming devices, anything smart. <laughs> Number two pens. Why number two pencils? <laughs> that doesn't make sense. Uh, any objects considered iconic uh, representations of an archetypical uh, con concept, e.g., rubber dog ketchup bottles. All materials under bureau investigations is to be brought in through the uh, private entrance. Entr entrance. Wow, not interest. Um, if you see any lobby personnel uh, in reads of those politics, please notify your supervisor immediately. Fair enough. Please don't. But also, uh, apparently this area is in lockdown. Why did the door just open? Does it have a feeling stuff thing going on? 
Yes, so there was nothing else down here, right? Nope. Oh, it's good to be back in this kind of game. It's just been such a long time since I played something like this. Okay. I hope this sound. I saw it a long time ago. I keep seeing it in my dreams. TVA? Is that you? <laughs> uh, um, what do I have? Um, staffing surveillance redacted. Uh, data center initiative construction redacted. Redacted. Minor of experience of his experience. Experiment. Janitor. Uh, Gen Janitoria? I think. Uh, cost redacted. Word removal. HQ. Okay. For most prisoners. Okay, it doesn't seem to be that important, but it's there. Uh, while running to sprint. Oh, right. Um, oh, that's just the bathroom. Bathroom. Wow, I can't even talk. So nothing of it. Why don't you have any mirrors here? That's weird. Federal Bureau of Control. All these years, I've been looking for them, and they were hiding oh, in plain yeah. sight. How do? Why? Oh, they're all from the other side. That's weird. That you can see in from this side, but not get to them. Unless... Of course you can go around. Hello? Hello? Hey, excuse me. There you are. You are here about the job. Janitor's assistant. You need to go to the interview. Okay. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm a janitor, by the way. You work for me. You can say I sent you. If they don't hire you, they tell you go to hell of it. There be work for the axe. Take them behind the sauna, you hold. Okay. I've done enough night shift loner jobs to know it makes us come off weird. Welcome I'm to the oldest the house. Friendly face in my book. Uh, Somebody with no face at all. <laughs> Think about it. No face. Um. Oh, cleaning in progress. I was just like, why does the wet floor signs here? That didn't make sense <laughs> on the carpet. The cell and the poster. I was 11 years old the first time I saw behind the poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. Will you help? Maybe. I'll say the game looks gorgeous though. I don't know how old it is uh, at this point though. But it looks really good. We like it. But I heard rumors, and you can discuss that down in the comments below, of course. Also, always, or tell me. Uh, but I heard rumors that this might be connected to um, Alan Wake uh, in some way, shape, or form. That it takes place in the same universe. Um, I have not played Alan Wake, by the way. I have seen, I think it's Gap Smolder play it. Um, I think it was her. So, I could be wrong. Did I lose you there for a moment? Maybe. You know what's on my mind. My baby brother, Dylan. 17 years since the men of this bureau took him. What the fuck has happened here? Can I turn this off? 
Someone dead. Wait, still alive. Oh, it's that thing up there. Okay. Uh, what did we get? Uh, missions. Welcome to the oldest house. Okay, that's just information about what I'm to go about to do. Um, reminder of uh, redrafting any public facing material. While pending, uh, pending any notifications of death related to the willow or uh, please adhere to the following guidelines. Uh, words and phrases to use. In, this, um, in the service of his or her country, regret, proud, pride, will be remembered. Words phrases to avoid. Alaska <laughs> scissors. Blood bleed laws. Apologies, sorry. Why Alaska and <laughs> scissors? Okay, so that's just. Uh, oh, it just sets to unread. That's nice. That they have a tap like that. And I can't get in there. And this one just loops around, apparently. Yeah. And I guess it's the same with this one. I wish you had something you can highlight with to see if you're missing stuff somewhere. Oh, oh that is also a good term um, indicator. Let's see. Federal Bureau of Control, Barbara. I'm not to be disturbed. Uh, cancel all my appointments for the day. For the rest of the week. Okay. I can't trust them. Barbara, not a single one. Trench. That was a gunshot. Shit. Well, he's dead. Shit, shit, shit. You want me to pick it up? The murder weapon? Yes. Really? I have a feeling he's talking to the player. That's kind of creepy, actually. Results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one, ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner, and you, <laughs> you're it. <laughs> Okay. Where am I? Okay, this looks awesome. But other than that, yeah. <laughs> Where the fuck am I? Oh god. I almost did not make that jump. Can I climb? Um, okay, I take it. But why we? Why not actually one of the buttons I actually have? The same gun. Obtain the service ribbon achievement card. Okay, there we go. Okay, I can change sides, which I look at. I still don't like to be down here. There we go. 
Oh, I have a crouch. Let's see. I'm thinking of mapping that V button to my mouse instead because that's way out for pressing. Something's coming. This threat. An attack. Duty as director. Keep the bureau safe. Did you hear that? It's the dead man. Right after the pyramid spoke to me and it was just noise and I understood every word. And this gun's alive. You know what? I'm happy. Happy to be here. Okay. I'm not. Things have quieted down outside. Is it safe to go? What is this? Is this just light? It doesn't seem like a window. Oh, I have a map. Um, oh, that's nice. I can move around on the map while I can see the map. I like that. Nope, it has not quite down on here. <laughs> Good. Oh, yeah. Okay, I do like that you don't have... Ow. Ow. <laughs> okay, so these are hills. Hills. Health. Uh, oh, maybe I can do this one now. Nope. Okay. Maybe back to the elevator. The hotline. Secure line of communication. Guide us. Reach the hotline. That was kind of my own fault. Let me get help. Anticipated building shift, follow these simple steps. Okay. One, search the room for any altered items or objects of power. Two, carry the altered item or object of power to the nearest safe room. Three, wait for bureau staff to find you and the object. If there are no altered items or objects of power in the vicinity, then reach your supervisor via the nearest intercom and await further instructions. Thank you for your attention. Bye bye, Tia. <laughs> Let's see what we have here. Oh, I have a lot of things apparently. 
So where's good to give them damage? Uh, and here we have info about the weapon. Reminder. Oh right. I don't think I've seen this one, have I? Objects of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Okay, I have seen this one. Um, rising cost of all experience. Okay. So this feels like some kind of um. Where am I supposed to go, by the way? Uh, but yeah, this feels like some kind of um, SCP containment, br uh, containment facility or something like that at the moment. Okay, I've already been here, so that's forward or backward. Uh, I can't remember how... That's the toilet. This down here must not be the other toilet. Yeah. Where's the elevator? Get something over here. More information. Well, let's see. Dinner reservation at 7 p.m. at Chest Ember. Why will we meet you there? Don't be late. Uh, flowers are ready for you at your lobby reservation. Remember, she is turning 46. Oh. Can I use this? Also, that is the elevator thing, I think, maybe. Unrefined something. Hmm. Okay, uh, for Marshall's eyes only. Marshall, we checked out the uh, suspected or what is or actually uh, in Dulu Duluth Duluth. I don't know how to pronounce that word. Uh, wasn't anything. Just like the house fire before this, and the malfunctioning uh, cloth dryer uh, before that, my team is getting pretty sick of uh, of dudes, of dots. Sorry, uh, we need to find a better way to sort the fake ores from the real things, or you need to rotate those fields, uh, field agents off for a bit. Anyway, uh, we're around to uh, Shaman Ranch, uh, next one on the list. Let's hope there's a little lively idea there. Sincerely, Special Agent Keenum. Okay, so yeah, they are going after something altered stuff. Central Executive. The hissing sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? All right, it's our enemy. Also, that's creepy that with all the people. Contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over. Nope. <laughs> don't want to have any sounds I don't need to have here. That was just a radio. God, there's a lot of documents. Urban Legends. Urban Legends, I believe, uh, to affect the creation of altered materials, but can also direct the characteristics of an altered world event. Urban Legends are understood as the modern evolution of Jung's archetypes. I think uh, we recognize certain redacted information by our own redacted and populate uh, populate populate. Hi, what? Popularized uh, by our media. Popularized, wow. 
We have additional proof that urban legends can even be artificially redacted. In popular culture using redacted, our bureau uh, made anthology, the television program. Once the seeds are sown, human imagination ex exact the detail. <laughs> I have no clue about that word, how to pronounce it. Uh, certain uh, power natural phenomenons, certain clear elements of popularization, popularized, I think it's popularized, uh, folklore, uh, ores that are only occurred in redacted, a pair of scissors and consumed humans, <laughs> human redacted, <laughs> okay, uh, those two purchases, uh, I can't read for some reason, uh, punctures on the blank. Uh, these I, I will just say blank is then subtracted. It's much easier. Uh, these details, living in the mind of so many, uh, have been given strength uh, through uh, beliefs. Urban legends are not just stories for children. They are personal. Pa pa sorry, paranormal, power <laughs> natural. <laughs> well, um. Realities uh, waiting to happen. Refer to file four nine three six nine four two for full report. Okay, uh, what do we have up here? There are really a lot of documents. <laughs> I didn't expect that, especially taking how bad I'm at reading. How to handle unauthorized visitors entering the lobby? Start with the following. Welcome to the Federal Bureau of Control, established in 1964 as part of an effort to strengthen government relationships, relations. We are proud to serve the United States and have people and her people as we strive for transparency and excellence in all aspects of our esteemed national infrastructure. Okay. If they do not leave, uh, then ask them these questions. Are we here to see someone? Too? Are you from <laughs> Are you from New York City or just visiting? How you find this place? If their answers are sufficient, harmless, explain that this is a secure federal office, and that they need to leave. If their answers seem blank, it's got into a private room. They perform a uh, gunner's physical physiological examination <laughs> assessment. Wow, I can't read. If the responses are within the uh, acceptable range of deviance, see the provider's uh, sorting sheet, then blank immediately. Remember, there are no such thing as too suspicious. Fair enough. Um, I came from there. This looks normal. Uh, was I in here? Yeah, that was the radio. Um, can I just jump down there? I thought I had full health. I saw wrong apparently. <laughs> First death. Better. I say it's almost die. Ready, 
Okay, can't do anything with this apparently. The control point. What does that mean? This thing. Fix it. Looks like things turn back to normal now. Holy shit. Still with that one on top. Yeah. Are you with us? With the bureau. Are you still sane? I can't tell you how happy I am to talk to somebody sane. The feeling's mutual. Yeah, I'm Pope, Emily Pope, a Dr. Darling's assistant. My turn. Should I lie? Jesse Faden. I'm just visiting. I should have lied. Oh, shit. You're the new director. Hold on. We're coming out. Wait, what? Director Faden. Call me Jesse. Okay, Jesse. I'm Emily. Look, somehow this hostile force, this hiss. That works. Somehow the hiss managed to infiltrate the building without any warning. And just like that, my name for it is official. The hiss. Like the sound of poison gas leaking in. We're in full lockdown. It seems to have spread everywhere and to everyone not protected by an HRA. And, extraordinarily, you. You are the director, and that makes you special by definition. Trench is no longer the director, obviously. He <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, I'm talking too much. This whole situation is just a lot. Trench is dead. Shot. Ah, I found his body. And the gun. Do I tell her it looked like a suicide? The service weapon. Also, and this can sound crazy, but he keeps appearing to me, saying things. It's hard to make out, but he told me to cleanse the control point, push the hiss out. The whole room shifted around. You did that? And you entered the building when it was already in the lockdown before you became the new director? How? I'm not ready to tell I'm you. I'm apparently special. A janitor let me in. <laughs> I love it. This is fucking unbelievable. It's... I can't even... Uh, look, Jesse, I have a million questions, and you probably have a million more. Like, do you know my brother Dylan? Not yet. But there's something I need to ask you to do first. If you can cleanse a control point, then you can maybe cure those infected or possessed by the hiss. Because if that's possible, our options are very different Emily Pope I don't know her but I like her already she's the opposite of the faceless agency I've blamed for what happened to me for so long but I can't trust her yet or rather the bureau she's a part of yes I can try I'm speaking for you of course we can try it together Still creepy as fucking hell. Anything important in here? We did it before. Push the hiss out. Is that just an emergency? Okay, that's just a door. Uh, I guess I have to do it with these people. <laughs> but I guess that worked. She disappeared. Okay. It didn't work. The hiss has burrowed too deep. Ripping it out rips them apart. What can I do with this one still since it's still here? Over here. 
Ok. I'm gonna tell her why I'm here. I'll risk it. Listen, the bureau was involved in an incident in my hometown, ordinary, 17 years ago. The bureau came in and covered the whole thing up. I've been looking for this place for a long time. That's enough. Maybe that's too much already. I can't tell her about Dylan and the rest yet. I've seen mentions of an altered world event case dealing with Ordinary. You were at Ground Zero as a child? It was one of the big ones, and before my time. And very classified. I can try to dig out some old files for you. My boss, Casper Darling, would know, but he's missing. I think he knew this was coming, or suspected. He came up with the HRAs, the Hedron Resonance Amplifiers. I think they're what saved us, or a few of us. And Director Trench would know. Trench, the ghost, or whatever he is. He mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. It's another object of power, like the gun, an old Bakelite telephone. A direct line of communication between the director and the board. Maybe he can talk to you more clearly through that. I mean, Trench has years and years of experience. He might know how to destroy the hiss. Where is the hotline? It's kept in the communications department through the mailroom. It's part of this sector, so we can access it even with the lockdown in place. We'll get the door open for you. Thank you. Okay, that's my next stop. That's Tomasi's department. He's the head of communications. I don't think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. Keep an eye out. They call me the director. But that's not me. I'm not a director type. I'm not a leader. Why am I here? I think you already know. Yes, I came for my brother, but there are other reasons, too. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. I can understand that. I'm not looking for proof. This is already it. More than enough. No matter what they told me all those years, I know it's real now. I didn't imagine this. I want to be a part of this world. What scares me shitless is that I finally found it. Only to see the hiss destroy it all. So that is uh, not an object of power? Is that enough? So that is my goal now. Look, I know this is all new to you, so don't hesitate to ask me anything you want to know. There are no stupid questions. Actually, there is. The door to the comms department is just outside the boardroom back in the lobby. Thank you. you. should have gotten it open by now. Yeah, I'm still curious to what I can do here. Oh, it's a fast travel. And apparently outfit. I have one outfit. <laughs> Um, so my goal is that direction. I'm not sure about that map. It confuses me a little. Uh. There it is again. Our welcome message. Can I open this?
Anyone else? Oh, so it's in green, so I can't shoot any of these guys. Uh, the way I needed to go is not this way. Nope, it's also not this way. It's overpowering here. <laughs> you don't want me anywhere near it. With all that. Oh, hello there. That went well. Oh. Little letters. I like the side cards. <laughs> Goes a little better with the shooting. Okay, is this another cleansing point? Awesome when everything just splits back to where it's supposed to be. <laughs> okay, where from here? Oh, all the way over there now. Okay. Communications. We're on the right track. Did it say that? Oh. I got blood on my shoes. Hello. What the fuck? <laughs> An object of power. I need to get up there, so it was just a stupid idea to actually jump down here. There we go. Give me that. seal are they really the ones pulling the strings maybe i'm not their director i'm no one's director uh, he'll need to grab
Okay, I have telekinesis apparently. Didn't mean that. <laughs> Okay, so I have a red bar at least on the top I can see when I use my telekinesis. That's a really good range. you wanted right this will help me fight the hiss oh I like this ability. I can also just lift off the ground, holy crap. somewhere okay, yeah, so we are over here pressing all the freaking wrong buttons Where's my goal? I'm up here. Pretty sure I need to go this way. Emily said that the hotline can be reached through the mail room. So mail room was this way. Oh, I really like the signing actually. I should be more vigilant of those. Oh, this one can't, can't open, I think. Locked. Maybe there's a key nearby. This must open the door. What do we have here? Oh, 
so I fast travel. Nice. I do like that I have fast travel so I can get fast around in the areas. Hello! You look kind of uh, creepy. How do I fight that guy? Okay. Oh, there was more than one. Oh, God dang it, I pressed the wrong button. Don't like this guy. Oh god, and not this guy too. There we go. Oh god, he's not easy. Well, hopefully I can get some health now. I have a feeling he'll be back. Me too. Let's stay focused. The hotline should be past the mail room. Uh hotline chamber. Oh yeah, I had to go this way. I have to get higher. This is to be the right way. Yeah. All right, take this down. The situation in Cuba has been evaluated by the relevant authorities. The mysterious illness affecting the staff at the U.S. Embassy in Havana was caused by sonic weaponry in the hands of a foreign power. Numerous personnel have damage to the inner ear, but most are expected to make a full recovery. Of course, the event also damaged their cellular walls, but we can't blame that on some stupid noise gun. <laughs> okay. I know local doctors examined them first. Honestly, what are the odds an altered item would show up inside a U.S. Embassy? Talk about good luck, huh? <laughs> so much easier to... Hey, are you still recording this? <laughs> <laughs> yep, yeah, here we are. Oh, now I'm just using my telekinesis to own things. Oh, a health boost. Nice. Is that items I need to use somehow? Health recovery per limited pickup, energy recovery per speed. Let's just get some. Apparently I have nothing I can add for that. 
you do that one. No clue. Can I unlock any of these? Okay. Hotline can't be far now. I did not know that was a thing I had. <laughs> I got turned around for some reason. <laughs> that happens. Hotline chamber. How do I get over there? Whoa. Oh. Have we been here before? No. I've stayed at a lot of roadside motels across the country, on the road, on the run, under the radar. This feels like all of them, like something recognized from a dream. Oh, I don't even have my gun anymore. That was a cool transition, though. I did not expect them to open doors. Key has a black pyramid on it. Yeah, so that is for oops, sorry. That is for this one down here. It's, it's so fucking awesome made. <laughs> I love it. I hope this was not important. I picked it up by mistake. That's just wrong everything. <laughs> Sorry. What is this about? Uh, the Hutton will allow you to contract, uh, contact, stimulate enemies. Uh, okay, I'm not sure what that means. Okay, I have no clue what I'm supposed to do here. Well, maybe this one works. Let's just get them to follow me. So I can get past these. Is 
It is a phone. It's an object of power. It doesn't connect to any typical network. A direct line to the astral plane and the board. And my hypothesis is, under the right conditions, to other planes of existence as well. Okay. That's just a knob you can spin, I think. A director needs a team. My management team. These people know the secrets of the Bureau as well as I do. Some even better. Darling, Tomasi, Salvador, Marshall. Marshall especially, my head of operations. She sees right through me. She knows I don't like relying on people. The only person you should fail is yourself. But things change when you become director. Okay. <laughs> that can't be good. I have it. The hotline. I can reach Trench. Well, listen to him. He feels more like an echo. An echo with important info. Uh, I need to get back to Emily. And what? People react strongly when I tell them about you. Is it too soon to tell Emily? She might be able to help. Maybe? Okay, I'm on the right track, yeah. Oh, I'm here now. Fair enough, that makes it a lot easier to get back where to where I need to be. I think. Uh, I actually need to go this way. <laughs> I'm big. Hello. You're not Emily. <laughs> Emily is probably yeah, up there. Jesse, did you get the hotline? I mean, how is it out there? The comms, the hiss? Sorry. You made it. Yes, can I? Play Emily? This one? Let's talk. Of course. <laughs> I say, as I don't go to where the fuck she is. <laughs> Okay. Hello. I got the hotline. I can make out what Trench is saying now. Incredible. What did he say? He talked about his management team. People who knew the Bureau of Secrets. Your boss, darling. Tomasi, but he's gone. He has gone. Salvador? He's the head of security. And Marshall? Helen Marshall is head of operations. She's tough, ex-CIA. She took her rangers and went to the research sector to secure the HRA production. She hasn't come back. Someone who could help us. The other sectors. How do I get there? It's impossible because of the internal lockdown. You can perform a directorial override to lift it, but that can only be done in the maintenance sector. Normally, you take the sector elevator down there. It connects all the sectors. But it won't work while the lockdown is in effect. So I have to take the stairs. Past one lockdown. Maybe I can find a way. Jesse, look, with no prep, no training in this extreme situation, you are doing phenomenally well. And all that and the hiss can't seem to affect you. I mean, I would love to run some tests on you. If you agree, that is. We could find out something that would help us. Tests. I don't know. She might find out about you. But I wouldn't mind understanding more myself. Okay. If you think it will help. Great. I'll check the internal documentation for any lockdown bypasses. We need to get these sectors open to locate Darling and Marshall. And I'll look for a way inside the maintenance sector. The sooner we find one, the sooner I reach this override. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, we know what we have to do, apparently.
There's still a question about the janitor, by the way. <laughs> a little... Walkway, where are you leading to? Probably some horrible stuff. <laughs> that I have to overcome some way, shape, or form or another. Seems nice. Did you find anything? Hi, Jesse. Hello. Bye bye. Yes, <laughs> I'm sure I'll have more questions soon. Just let me know. Yeah, that was not important for anything, apparently. Um. Do you hear that? Someone's singing. Where is it coming from? Singing. Sounds like it's coming from the elevator. Okay, where's the elevator in comparison to where I am? Oh. Dying word meet me in the main denounce. Uh, maintenance. Like I said before, the janitor is a friendly face. Still don't love him. I like him. Why did I say love but to begin with? That was not what I was going for at all. <laughs> I have questions about my own sanity at times. The maintenance sector is the janitor domain. If I can find Ati here, he can help me reach the override. Maybe. Maybe it was you who got me into the oldest house with the lockdown on. Maybe it was Ati. It felt like he made the elevator appear that took me to Trench's office. That still don't if seem Ati like a good thing. Okay, I'm guessing that is... Where am I? I'm up there. Okay. Oh, that is locked, so I have to go this way. Okay. Fair enough. Then we're going down this. The directorial override is right there in the control room. Not I evil hallway. Pressing all the wrong buttons. Holy crap, I'm bad at this. <laughs> also, really wish that this game actually has a difficult settings because it seems harder than it should be. Or maybe it's just me <laughs> as an idiot. <laughs> I really need to be better at using my powers now that I actually have them. Okay, let's get rid of the mist. Got a hiss. I actually think they called it. <laughs> I 
And I am full of health. Goody, goody. Anything of interest? Nope. I can kill people so easier if I do this. See? If I could hit, of course, <laughs> that is another thing. here what's down that way what way this nope Okay. So this is another object of power or something. Oh, this place makes me nauseous. An object of power. Yeah. How do you think it got down here? I don't know. A carousel horse. Why is kid stuff always so creepy? <laughs> That was the wrong one here. I'm wondering what this gives me. Control to evade. Oh. I don't get this one. Well, it seems like a really useful ability. Both enemies are immune to just its attacks. Yep, I can see that. The uh, golden enemy is immune to just attack. Use evade to stay to avoid the attacks. Okay, I don't have unlimited of these. Useful. And I can't see shit. <laughs> I didn't need the floor anyways. Oh, I thought it was something. Guess not. Time to find the janitor. Uh, 
Oh, hello there. Hiding away from me. Oh. Hello, janitor. Maybe. Well done. You got the job. It's place for congratulations. Yippee, Satana. It happened in the last drop. I truly need an assistant. Funny thing is, I've been a janitor. I'm more at home in that role than as the director. <laughs> Only Ati here seems to see that. Yeah, hi, Ati. Look, we need to get the lockdown lifted. Otherwise, I can't get to the other sectors. Can you help me get to the override? Yes, yes. Easy peasy. It's just around the corner. I don't like him. But first, we need to get you working. Very small couple of hours job. Something tells me it's going to be more than that. Yeah, yeah, you think there's a dog buried in this? I can tell you are not the yesterday's Krause's son. That's why you make a great assistant. Very well. I'll hit the facts on the table. I'm out of a little swore that this house has a vermin problem. A bad one. They've already messed up the cooling pumps. And the power generators of a power plant particular. And the pensioner inside is starting to feel the band around his head tighten. The situation needs to be fixed before the plant blows up. And we all disappear like a part in Sahara. <laughs> trying my best to keep up with this. I'm trying to best to understand so half the things he says. And the power generators, otherwise the power plant will blow. But don't you worry. I've left you clear instructions. You'll catch the end of the trip before I go to my vacation. The works on the task board here. You can do later when you have time. Vacation. Right. Yes, no one's gonna cancel my holiday or see it's gonna rattle. But don't worry at all. You'll take care of it and soon this crisis is gonna be last winter snow. You better go now, so you don't have to run with your head as your third leg. The door in the back leads to the plant. The door in the back. That's great. Thank you, Ati. Okay. Um so that's the door in the back. This one is yep. side mission. Burn the dress. Throw it in the fire. Burn it all. Burn it into a reindeer. Not Where am I actually going right now? Uh, maybe the wrong way. Oh, so this just opens up so I can get past some more areas now. Okay, so what happens again if that thing blows up? Power. Explosion. Too much. Director's duty. Keep the light on. Was this the way? Maybe. <sighs> oh, this way. <laughs> Seems right. That's the only thing with this map. I wish I could uh, switch between the layers of it to make it a little easier to see. But that's that's my only grief. That oh, hello there. Oh, you actually have a suit on, so you don't attack hey. me. Hey, are you new? Yeah. Go talk with Chief Arish in the security booth. He's in charge here. 
Let's just do this so we have a fast travel. Where can I talk to that um, person you talked about in the booth? Nope. <laughs> yeah, I'm a fucking idiot. Hey, Chief Arish, FBC Security. Shouldn't you be in a safe room? <laughs> I just had to go in here. <laughs> We're on the same side. My name is Jesse Faden. I'm here to perform the directorial override to get the lockdown lifted. Yeah, yeah, Chief Arish, FBC Security. I'm just. Hang on, you're the new director. <laughs> um, it's a pleasure, ma'am. Let's skip the formalities, please. Right. Faden, ma'am. Look, as you can probably tell, uh, it's a bit of a shit show down here. We've been holding our ground, but whatever's gotten into our buddies has them wrecking the coolant pumps and the power converters. The NSC keeps overheating, and my crews keep getting shot before they have a chance to make any repairs. NSC? Oh, sorry. Bureau jargon. It's what we call the power plant. You know, the uh, big rumbling metal thing? <laughs> uh, Salvador, head of security, asked me to protect it in case of an attack. See, what's inside is dangerous. And Dr. Darling seemed to know it would be a target. Darling? He's here? No, he came down a few days ago, before everything went to hell. He was out of it. He smelled like a bar mat. He was ranting about vulnerabilities and how he only had one large-scale HRA, but that he needed it somewhere else. Still, at least he gave us these personal HRAs before he left. Hey, did I mention that he was tearing his clothes off? <laughs> okay. Crazy dude. Darling knew the hiss was coming. Listen, I love playing 20 questions as much as the next guy, but we have got to get the water and electrical systems repaired before this baby blows. I'll have my guys unlock the doors out of here for you. I'll take care of it. You stay and keep the hiss away from the plant if you can. The hiss? That's what we're calling him? Well, that's catchy. Listen, the radios aren't working, so if you find my boss Salvador out there, could you please ask him what the plan is? I'm sure he will have one by now. I'll keep an eye out for him. He sure has a lot of faith in his boss. Try to stay alive. Goody. We need those pumps and converters online. Oh, I have a couple of places I have to go then. I just wanted to make sure. Also, there's something on the table here I can pick up. That is mine now. Bye bye. So, how do we get to those areas? Uh, one of them is this way. I'm itching for some real action. Yep. What is it we have here? Are they really just for goodies? <laughs> Nothing else. Okay, this one is leading to this. So I'm guessing this is my way forward, maybe? Where did the last one go? That was something. <laughs> okay, 
Hey, how's about that? <laughs> the one guy that exploded in my face really hurt. <laughs> Just it. Well, thank you for helping me. Oh god! I saw him so late. Damn, those guys hurts! Why is this guy so high to high? <laughs> so hard to kill. Okay, let's get this fixed. Seems like I have to go this way. Yeah. Nope. <laughs> oh, this place is gonna come down. I can't get up there yet. the other one that was shooting at me oh. that guy what was that bro, bro. go to shift fix it fast if the plant goes boom we can throw the spoon in the cold Hey, that should have been... That, I hope. Oh, where is this going? Enemy 
He is very clever. He is trying to sneak in. He got him caught with his hand in the fist trap. Go faster. Okay. Okay, so that one actually can do that. Do anything against that. I'm just running in circles now. That was the wrong button. I'm so used to placing E to open things, so... We need to fix this thing ASAP. Yeah, how the fuck do I get out? <laughs> Somewhere here? No. Maybe up here. Okay, I already fixed that one. This. Back there. Okay, there was one. Can I use the elevator now?
That is 100% not the way to fight that guy. Oh, for fuck's sake, I sidestepped right into him. <laughs> I've been dead way too many times doing this let's play so far. And it's only episode one, what the hell? <laughs> Did I get him? Holy fuck. <laughs> I just threw everything at him. Just hanging out, let's call it that. You're shooting at something. Hello. Either I'm really doggy or they are really stormtroopers right now. I say as one of them explodes in my fucking face. Hello. All of them. Are you alive? Pipe C through F. Is the clock back? Now. Oh man, Adi is gonna be so pissed. <laughs> okay, where do we have the next one? Okay, so that's. This one over here. Oh god damn it! <laughs> that was stupid. I, hoped, I thought I could do that. <laughs> nope. Oh man, <laughs> hopefully no one is counting all my deaths, because that is horrible so far. Where did it place me actually? Oh, all the way here, so I have to go around and take the elevator up again. Okay. Well, while I'm running back to where we were before, I actually think I will end this uh, episode off for today because it had gone on a little too longer than expected. So, I say that all the time. It has actually gone on as long as I expected because I want these to be around two hours. Um, 
before editing. So thank you all so much for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed this. You can give it a thumb up if you did. You it really helps out the channel as always. And until next time, take care everyone and goodbye.